You know, Michael Popak really sets the mood with his legal AF after dark intros. It's interesting how he's taking on Donald Trump's case. He mentions Trump's almost comical attempt to use absolute immunity for crimes committed in office. The first appeal is already lined up for next week. It's going to be quite an event. They plan to cover the whole process on Midas Touch Network and Legal AF, right up to the Supreme Court. It's crucial to stay informed about the briefings, like Jack Smith's special counsel filing and Trump's use of dubious evidence. Trump's approach of citing anonymous sources and fraudulent claims in his appeals court brief is quite unusual. Popak says they're offering a guide to this unprecedented situation. Legal AF's latest episode breaks down the complexities of the upcoming oral argument. Trump's contempt motion against Jack Smith is quite frivolous, especially during the ongoing appeal process. Popak seems confident that the D.C. Circuit Court will rule against Trump on presidential immunity. The oral argument on January 9 is expected to be intense and possibly damaging for Trump. The court might be very critical of Trump's claim to king-like immunity. Trump's argument hinges on the contested election, but it's based more on his social media than on legal precedents. He's using his own posts as evidence, ignoring the multiple court cases he lost. It's quite unusual for someone to cite themselves in a legal argument. This whole situation is an attack on the legal system, using tweets as legal citations. The D.C. Circuit Court is working on an expedited schedule for this case. Trump's opening briefs were due last December 23. And Jack Smith's response was due a week later, on December 30.